I was recently made aware of a story of someone who had been on a whole food plant based diet who developed hypothyroidism and they thought their vegan diet caused it. Now of course without knowing someone's full medical history and what they were exactly eating we can't really begin to speculate on why they became hypothyroid which is an underactive thyroid condition. However I heard a brilliant interview with Dr Michael Greger and I wonder whether what he discussed there could actually be relevant in this case. Now some of the healthiest plant foods are flax seeds, broccoli, kale, soy and cauliflower but what do they all have in common? They all contain goitrogens and goitrogens are naturally occurring substances that can interfere with the function of the thyroid gland. So should we cut out these foods to prevent developing a thyroid problem? Well let's take a listen to what Dr Greger had to say. That uh, contain these so called goitrogenic compounds that can interfere with the uptake of iodine into the thyroid gland such that those who eat for example soy and broccoli who have marginal iodine intake can impair their ability of their thyroid to make thyroid hormones. The answer is not to remove these amazingly healthy foods like soy, broccoli and flax seeds. It is to just make sure you have enough iodine. Then it doesn't matter how much soy or broccoli or flax seeds you eat and you make all the thyroid hormone you want. So where do you get iodine from? Healthy source is really sea vegetables. So I encourage people to snack on nori seaweed sheets that you make uh, for sushi. Super healthy snack. Um, add mild seaweeds like uh, dulse or arame to soups and I mean, there's all sorts of ways to be sound. Um, but yeah, so you just, as long as you have enough iodine intake, you don't have to worry. To learn more about iodine and plant based diets, be sure to check out these two videos, linked below. If you're having problems on a vegan diet, this video may also be of some help. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment below, and subscribe for more upcoming videos.